Hello everybody, my name is Python and welcome back to another episode of Python's Realm. Thank you so much once again for the amount of support you showed in the previous episode, reaching well over a thousand likes once again. And don't forget guys, if you are still hyped for the series and want to continue seeing more, do be sure to drop a like rating. And uh, by the way, Editor Python, can you actually get the amount displayed on screen correct this time? I mean seriously man, you've messed up two episodes in a row, so... You know, get it right, you're supposed to be the editor, you're supposed to get it right. Yeah. Don't you backsass me? What's up with you, man? Good lord. <laughs> oh, dear. Anyways, guys, in the previous episode, if you did not see, we took down the wall of flesh, and we are now in hard mode, expert mode, and things are looking really freaking awesome. So we're starting off today with strange plants, because, uh, well, I've been saving these up for hard mode on purpose, because you can actually get new dyes in hard mode. You can get better dyes in hard mode than you can in uh, regular mode. So let's go ahead. Uh, how many do we have in total? Uh, oh, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 7, 8, 9, 10. Uh, we've got 11. Oh, dang, dude. All right, 11 loads. Let's just go ahead and spam it. Hey, there we go. Oh, look at this, man. Holy crap. All right, we've got to see which one looks best, dude. All right, so we've got reflective dye. Boom, boom, boom. Which doesn't make me look too different, to be honest with you. Okay, so now we have reflective metal dye. Ooh, look at me. I look kind of fancy. Okay, I'm actually rather liking that one. That's kind of cool. All right, moving on. We've got shadow flame Hades dye. Oh, wow. Huh. If I had one of the Halloween outfits, I think this would look kind of cool. Okay, so that's a contender. So these two are the contenders so far. Negative die. Uh, ooh. No, no, no. I'm going to sell those ones straight away. I don't really like them ones. Okay, so moving on, we've got Mirage die. Um, that's literally done absolutely nothing. Okay, well, let's move on to the purple ooze die. Ooh. Purple die. Hey, man, that's not looking too bad, is it? All right, Twilight die. Uh, that's looking kind of nice. That's a contender for sure. I like that. And moving on, we have ourselves the blue acid dye, which looks okay. But these three here are definitely the contenders, in my personal opinion, for the best dyes. So, let's go ahead and sell the rest of them, because they do sell for a nice amount. Two gold, 25 silver each. So, yeah, I mean, we're going to get ourselves a decent amount of money from selling these little babies. So, yeah. Awesome stuff, awesome stuff. Oh yeah, that's right, I got a money truck. I don't have to go down to the piggy bank anymore. Hey, I like that! That's awesome! Alright, sweet, so I'm gonna go ahead and put on the reflective metal die, because that makes me look absolutely amazing, quite frankly. And, uh, let's see, can we put anything on the rest of this stuff? What if I put ref what if I put this stuff on? What? I am the Dark Knight! Heather to my will! Oh, look at this, man. Good lord. <laughs> <laughs> That's so sweet. That is brilliant. But anyways, guys, let's go ahead and uh, have a bit of a, a check on the world because uh, I don't know where the hallow is. And I feel like it will be a good idea to go ahead and find out. So let's go ahead and uh, head over to the right-hand side towards the desert biome project base thingy of awesomeness. Uh, oh, oh. Uh, well, this would appear to be the hallow. Ah, dang it. Well, at least we actually have a proper hallowed biome this time. And... Uh, oh. Okay. Uh, this is moderately interesting. What appears to have happened, ladies and gentlemen, is my desert base has been hallowified. <laughs> That's kind of cool. But the good news is that the NPCs will still live in hallowed biomes. They just won't wind up living in corruption biomes. So I'm pretty glad that it's hallowed instead of corruption. Because otherwise this entire project would have been a complete flawed bust. And it would have been very annoying. So yeah. I kind of like it though. I mean look at the hallowed sand on top. That's kind of awesome man. That's really really cool. Huh. Okay, sweet! Hey buddy, how you doing, man? You gonna get killed, son? Get out of here! You think you can bloomin' open and close my doors at your own will? Get out of here! You ain't doing that again, Sonny Jimbo. Alright, so yeah, let's go ahead and move on to the first proper thing for the episode. Oh, guys, check this out! It is raining, which means if we head over to the ice biome, we can, we can probably start farming out some ice golems because, uh, you know, I'm just gonna throw it out there, you know, the uh, good old frost armor is a pretty good armor to go for, I'm just saying. And also, even if I don't manage to get, uh, you know, frost armor, then, uh, you know, the ice wings would also be a good thing to go for. So, yeah, I need to go ahead and grab out some uh, slightly more epic weapons. So let's go into the brand new weapons chest, which I crafted since the last episode. And uh, let's have a quick look right here. We've got a, got a cascade, which I think is going to replace that. Uh, this is going to be made defunct. I don't really want it. Uh, nor the vile thorn. Uh, I feel like these 
lot will probably stay. Okay, so moving on, we've got the Flame Lash, Demon Scythe, and Manic Laser Rifle. I'm going to put this on. Hey, there we go. Freaking awesome, man. Yeah, Flower Fire. I'm liking it. All right, so you two can go in there. We've got the dies here. I might put the dies in a generic chest somewhere. Um, we got generic chests everywhere. Do you know what? I'm actually going to put them in my piggy bank, because why the heck not? All right, boom, boom. All right, dies. There you go, man. All right, let's head over to the ice biome, and let's see about perhaps killing some ice golems. Oh, Mr. Nimbus Rod! So, do you know what you're going to do for me right now? You're going to drop a Nimbus Rod, yeah? Yeah? Yeah, Nimbus Rod. Oh, dang it. Oh, Mr. Nimbus. You know what's coming your way? Hmm? Death. And you know what's going to come my way? A Nimbus Rod. Right? You're going to give me a Nimbus Rod, yeah? Yeah? No Nimbus Rod? Oh, dang it. What the heck, man? Why are you not giving me a Nimbus Rod? What the heck? Oh, good. I'm almost dead, actually. Holy crap. Uh, so I should uh, probably do a better job of getting away, huh? Oh, let's get out of here, man. Oh, snap, ladies and gents. The first battle is about to commence. Let's get this thing rolling, guys. Ah, oh, freaking yeah. All right, buddy. Here we go. All right, let's start off with the slime, though. We've got to start off small. Ah! Hey, oh, there we go. And now we can go ahead and just pwn the living heck out of this guy. <laughs> oh, mate, you ain't going to kill me. Not now. Hey, come back here. Hey! I did not give you permission to get out of here. I mean, what is up with you, man? Come on. Come on. Wait, really? Oh, oh, God, get out. Oh, snap. I might actually lose this battle. What the heck? All right, here we go. Kill them all. Ah, no, no. Oh, right, I'm out of here. <laughs> no, man. I thought I was going to take that guy down for sure, but he, he, he moved out, man. He was smart. He moved out, and my camping tactic did not work. Well, I, I'm not proud of myself, man. I should have been able to take that guy down, but it was not to be. Oh, guys, check it out. My first goodie bag in this world. Oh, that's freaking awesome, man. Okay, right, let's try and take these ice elementals down. Who knows? We might get a frost staff from them. Would be kind of awesome. All right, not from him. Maybe from this guy. Ah, dang. Well, the expert mode increased drop rates wasn't enough. Well done. All right, let's open this baby up and... Ooh! Yo, man. Wait. Oh, you idiot. Wait, what? I thought me shift-clicking stuff here would equip it. No! Oh, I've been a royal idiot. Whoops. I accidentally got rid of the Reaper hood and I kind of really wanted it. Ah, dang crapper. Well, there's my derp for the episode. Well, actually, there's been a few derps this episode. We've had the, we've had the ice golem fail and apparently these, the, the blooming goodie bags. Hey, all right, come on, man. Give me another one. Cat mask. What the heck? All right, let's put this on. Uh, I look a bit silly. All right, let's take it off. Hey, I look like I belong in this biome, man. Nah, I don't like it. Alright, let's put this back on. Sweet! Alrighty, let's keep going. Ooh, I just realised, check it out. It's a... It's a blizzard! What? This looks amazing! Yo! Hopping Jack, get out of here, man. What the heck? Oh, these guys want me, man. These guys want... I can't see! It's actually too dark! <laughs> it's too dark and the blooming snow's in the way! All right, well, I guess we can go ahead and uh, head back. And, well, I'm just thinking, actually, if it is, uh, what is it? Is, if it's a blizzard over there, it, will it be a sandstorm over in the desert biome? Because if so, I might go ahead and try and farm out some dudes over there. I think that'd be a cool idea to try and get the brand new set of armor that was added in 1.3.3, which I do believe is, uh, it's a new desert armor, but I can't remember what it's called, honestly, so, yeah. I'm gonna have to try and farm out it for it, and we'll see what happens. Ah, no sandstorm. Okay, so, well, there's a bit of a myth busted right there for you guys. If you've got a blizzard, it doesn't necessarily mean there's gonna be a sandstorm. Well, that's fine, I guess. Throwing a party at 4 a.m.? What the heck are these guys, man? I mean, night owls right here. Wow. <laughs> okay. Well, that's, that's fantastic. You guys are having a party once again without me. Why don't I ever get an invitation to these things? Man, I reckon we should. I reckon we should get invitations. I mean, we're the ones who built the blooming houses for them in the first place. Oh, hello. So, yeah, here's what you're going to do. You're going to go and give me a blooming Nimbus Rod, yeah? Yeah, Nimbus Rod? Hey, come on, man. You're going to, come on, you're going to do it. You're going to do it. Just, just give up on not giving me it, okay? Come on. Come on. And, oh, dang it. Oh, still no. Hey, Pinky, what are you doing around here, man? Get out of here, dude. <laughs> 
50 pink gel and two gold coins. Hey, man, I'll definitely take that. Well, guys, since it's not raining anymore, I guess we can go ahead and move on to something else we can be going ahead and doing, which is breaking demon altars and thus having a wraith swarm on us. Let me just have a quick look around home just to see if there are any... Oh! Okay, I think this might have to be a quick job. Oh, here we go. Cobalt. Oh, I actually saw that pop up right there. Wow. <laughs> not often you actually see the oars pop up right in front of your very eyes. All right, let's see you lot done. Oh, snapples. Oh, things are going to get real interesting real quick. Oh, snapples. There we go, there we go. All against the flame orang. Bringing a world of hurt to these guys. Alright, I seem to be doing damage to multiple segments of this dude. Oh, it's, oh that guy's dead. Oh, sweet, man. Wow, my flame orang is taking all the dudes down. My flamerang brings all the boys to the yard. Dang. Oh, what the heck? There's another one. Jeez. What the hell, man? How disrespectful. I just killed one of your brothers and you just well, spawned right on my butt. I don't want that. Get off me. Hey. You. You. Wraithy. Get out of here. And finally, you can also get out of it. I'm going to set fire to you in multiple sections so you can go ahead and get burnt. Go on. Get out of it. All right. There we go. How's he doing? 143 health. Jeez. This guy's crazy. Come on, man. Get out of here. There you go. As it should be. Absolutely pained. Alright, here we go. Uh, Oracalcum, Titanium, and Cobalt. Okay, so we've actually got a mixture of the two sets of ores, which is kind of cool. And there's more down here, in fact. So let's go ahead and break these up as well. And I'm going to take down the Wraith Swarm as well, or at least attempt to, so we can have an attempt at uh, getting ourselves... What is it? The Fast Clock or Megaphone? I can't remember what it is you get from these guys. It's something, basically. So... Yeah, let's kill all these guys. Hey! <laughs> and literally 15 seconds later, I get myself a fast clock. <laughs> Hell yeah, man. Oh, I love expert mode's increased rate of drops. It's awesome, man. Awesome indeed. Always worth getting a Wraith Swarm so you can get yourself one of the accessories for the Ankh Charm. Sweet! Oh my god, it's another Wraith Swarm. What the heck? Look at the amount of dudes here, man. What the hell? Yo! <laughs> <laughs> what even is this? Get off me, man. I'm gonna take all of you guys down. Hey, another fast clock. I mean, I'm gonna freaking take that as a reward, definitely. I blooming deserve it after all of this. Jeez. What the heck, man? Uh, is that all of you? Are you all dead now? Uh, hey. Defeat them all. As it should be. There we go. Sweet. Oh, check it out, guys. A blindfold. Another one of the accessories for the Ankh Charm. Alright, so that's two out of however many it actually takes. I think nine is ringing a bell, but I could be wrong. I have no idea. It's been a long time since I've made the Ankh Charm, so yeah, it's going to be pretty cool to do it. Ah, oh, no! I was gotten by vile spit. Well, dang crapper, there was a corruptor behind me. I didn't see him probably because the minimap was in the way. Eh, oh well. I'm still pretty, I'm still feeling pretty good about myself, to be honest. I mean, I got myself two accessories that I didn't have before. And uh, also, not only that, but we also have ourselves a bunch of cobalt we can start going ahead and mining. And therefore, we can get ourselves a bit of a start in terms of, you know, the, the, the hard mode tools and such. So, yeah. I'm still feeling pretty good, and not only that as well, we have ourselves a couple more strange plants we can go ahead and uh, trade, and actually there's are things I already have. Hades die, did that, did that actually do anything? I can't remember. Hold on, let me just uh, give it a real quick go. Hades die, ooh. Uh, I'm not sure about that one, that's uh, that's a bit of a wacky die. Yeah, I don't, I, I, I don't like that one, I'm just gonna throw it out there. Boom, you can go away, and boom, you can go play, and I'll put this back on. Sweet! Oh, hey there, Cobalt. Prepare to get mined. I'm gonna make you into a new pickaxe and you're gonna enjoy mining your next brother up. Oh, a calcum. Heck yeah. All right, let's get some more of this stuff. Wait, what? We've now got a bazaar? What the heck? Wait, hang on a sec. Don't those toxic sludges also drop vitamins? I'm pretty sure they do, but I don't know. I could be mistaken. Yeah, these toxic sludges here. I'm pretty dang sure they also drop vitamins, in which case, they're one of the few dudes that actually drop two types of accessories. Huh. In which case, that's kind of awesome. <laughs> Those guys are well worth going ahead and farming out, in which case, sweet. What? And now I've got a compass? Oh, don't look at her. Don't look at her. She won't do damage as long as I don't look at her. Hey, there we go. Come on. 
Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, get wrecked. There we go, get destroyed. Oh, yeah. I can't remember which update it was, but Medusas only spawn in uh, in hard mode now, which I've got to say, I could definitely appreciate in terms of, of a change. But obviously, the result of that is that she has been buffed, and I do believe she also drops a slightly more buffed Medusa head now, which, of course, as part of one of our major challenges, we are going to try and get. So, yeah. All right. In the meantime, I think it's time to regen some health. Ooh, bound wizard. Huh. Oh, don't, don't, no, 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 no. Don't kill him. Don't kill him, please. Don't kill him. Oh, man. I want to, I want to, I want to rescue him quickly, quickly. All right, uh, things to buy from you include the magic heart, maybe, and probably a crystal ball. In fact, I'm going to buy two of them just in case. A spell time or two. Uh, wizard's hat. I could buy a wizard's hat. What the heck? That's pretty cool. I'm pretty sure you couldn't do that before, but I could be mistaken. And uh, just for the hell of it, I'm also going to go and buy two stacks of uh, greater mana potions. Just in case we don't manage to get any a little bit later when he dies or something. So, yeah. Alrighty, guys. Here we are back at the surface. And we have 144 cobalt ore, which is pretty nice. Uh, how much are we going to get? 48. All right, that's a pretty healthy amount. Okay, so let's head down to the anvil down in the main base and let's see what kind of stuff we can make. Hopefully, we can make ourselves a bunch of awesome stuff. So let's start off with a cobalt pickaxe, of course, so we can mine Mithril and Orichalcum in the next episode, most likely. Uh, minus 20% knockback. I wouldn't mind getting a speed modifier in that. That'd be pretty cool. All right, and we have this, which is 10. This is 20 and this is 15. So a total of 45 bars are required to make a full set of cobalt armor. I don't think we're going to really need that, to be honest. Uh, cobalt sword, 47. I do believe that this is fully auto, but again, I don't really see a need for it. 38, 33. That damage is a bit on the weak side, if I'm honest. But like, then again, that's godly. Hmm... I might go ahead and buy it. Well, make it, should I say, not buy it. I'm not going to buy it. What the hell are you on about? I ain't never going to buy any cobalt tools. I'll make it. All right, so, hey, Mr. Dude. Mr. Dude, where'd he go? Am I blind again? I can't see him on the map. Uh, oh, he's right there. Man, you are so easy to lose, man. It's actually kind of ridiculous. All right, two gold is going to give us Murderous, which is 36 damage. I still reckon we can get more damage. There we go, godly. 39 damage, very, very slightly more. And, of course, it's full auto, so... Yeah, pretty happy about that. Awesome stuff. And, of course, let's get ourselves this thing going. Uh, something with more speed. Yep, quick will do the job very nicely. Sweet, guys. Sweet. I'm feeling pretty good about that, my friends. Alrighty. So, on that note, ladies and gentlemen, we are going to be ending the episode right there. I want to thank you guys for watching. If you did enjoy this rather wishy-washy, all-over-the-place episode, do be sure to drop a like rating. And, of course, you can hit that subscribe button if you want to know when the future videos are out. Stuff to do sort of in the more immediate immediate future include getting wings and uh, maybe farming out for some weapons, farming some mimics perhaps, that would be pretty dang cool. And of course if you guys have any suggestions for other things I need to go ahead and do, or you want me to do, then obviously the comments area is there for a reason. I always read the comments, so do be sure to head down there and leave your suggestions. But anyways guys, thank you so much for watching! On screen is the most recent video and also the playlist for this current series, so you can catch up if you so wish. But yeah guys, thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.